Well, community members are rallying to save a garden in Coney Island. It's a story we've been following for several months. The city decided to put a new amphitheater in its place. Residents say they are allowed to use the garden until construction begins, but recently someone tried to kick them out. News 12's Kenna Vernon has the story from Coney Island. This is what the Boardwalk Community Garden looks like in the summer. Lush, green, filled with fruits and vegetables. It means, uh, it means a lot of love. But recently, the city's planning commission voted in favor of the construction of the Seaside Park and Community Arts Center on the property. And now community members are protesting. They say they want to build for the community, but they want to hurt the part of the community to you know, build this thing for the other part of the community. And These neighbors say they don't want a new amphitheater. Stop city bureaucrats. They just want their community garden. In fact, they claim the city's parks department didn't follow the proper legal process to transfer the land to the city's economic development corporation back in 2004. We're not saying don't build an amphitheater. We're just saying don't build it here. I mean, people put their life and soul into this garden. The group says someone tried to kick them off the property just this Thursday. Uh, unknown individuals showed up to this garden and tried to bully some of these people off the land, uh, saying that they have a right to to vacate this lot and basically bulldoze it. But a spokesperson for the Parks Department says residents don't have the proper license to use the land as a community garden anymore. And it hasn't been a legal community garden in more than 10 years. So construction will continue. But these gardeners say they are still going to fight and will keep a patrol on the land both day and night. In Coney Island, Kenna Vernon, News 12, Brooklyn.